Which of the following expressions do not represent a real number? Real numbers are made up of the sets of rational and irrational numbers. Let's begin by reviewing the set of rational numbers. Rational numbers are the set of numbers that can be written in the form of a divided by b, where a and b are integers and b can't be zero. b can't be zero because division by zero is undefined. In decimal form, rational numbers terminate or repeat. So let's begin by identifying the rat. So we can get the given expressions. Because division by zero is undefined, if the expression represents division by zero, it is not real. So for example, this last expression, six over zero, means six divided by zero. Division by zero is undefined, and therefore this is not real, and therefore we select the expression. If we try to evaluate this on the calculator, notice how we do get an error, division by zero, which verifies it's not real. Now looking at the first expression, if we simplify eight minus eight is zero, the expression simplifies to nine divided by zero, and therefore this expression is also not real. But if we take a look at the expression 10 ninths, notice how it is in the form of a divided by b, where a and b are integers, and b is in zero, and therefore this expression is rational, and therefore it is real. Three can be written as a fraction as three over one, which satisfies the definition of a rational number, and therefore three is real. And now let's take a look at the square roots. Let's focus on this square root here first. In order for a square root to be real, the radicand, or the number under the square root, must be greater than or equal to zero. And that's because in order for this to be real, there must be a real number squared equal to negative 10. But we know a positive squared and a negative squared results in a positive value, and therefore the square root of negative 10 is not real. We select it. If we try to evaluate this on the calculator, notice how it states it's not real. And now let's take a look at the square root of zero. Since zero squared is equal to zero, the square root of zero is zero. And we can write zero in fraction form. For example, zero is equal to zero divided by one, and therefore the square root of zero is rational and therefore real, which leaves us with the square root of 13. Since 13 is greater than or equal to zero, this is real. Let's evaluate this on the calculator. And the calculator is going to round this. This decimal actually is non-terminating, and notice how it's also non-repeating, and therefore the square root of 13 satisfies the definition of an irrational number, where in decimal form, an irrational number is non-terminating and non-repeating. So the square root of 13 is real, and therefore we don't select it. So we have three expressions that are not real. I hope you found this helpful.